to the person who stole my selfie stick, you need to take a long look at yourself. This one was sent to me. It said, Via, I know you're always covering the auditors in, in America. We got them across the pond. I said, all right, let's do it. Hi guys, Laughing Odell here, coming to you from London, Euston Station. And that's my all members of the public. I filmed the cameras. Yeah, I'm alright. You can't take it. Says, says who? He's a security reader. I'm gonna be completely honest. I don't even understand exactly where he's at. I have zero experience with subways and all that whatnot. I'm from Ohio. Is it? Because I want to. You can't take the picture for, uh, for the camera. Why not? He's a security reader. Secure? Is it secure? Is the station secure? I'm mute all of a sudden. I can film anything I can see. Hold on, hold on. I can film anything I can see. Don't tell me that these guys were watching American auditors and picked up the same terminology. Because all of that slang and all the, the phrases that they use all originated from a guy who's not allowed to be around little ones. I'm not hiding it, I'm doing it in plain view. Look. So yeah, so it's a public area a minute ago. I can film whatever I want, except cameras, but... I can film whatever I want. A few moments later... What's the issue? Because you're talking to me, you're having an interaction. Okay. Like you make a video for the camera, you make a video for later, you make a video for... I know you're just a public area, but you can't take it. Said who? Said who? Sorry? Said who? What's... what law is that? Of course I'm allowed. Just because you're allowed doesn't mean you should. Just like we as people shouldn't need a sign to tell us we shouldn't do something. Public area? I'm not doing nothing wrong, mate. Like, I'm not being aggressive or nothing. Like. Just mind my own business. What's that little tea thing you've got on your vest? It's a little tool. Interesting. Do you want me to wait? Do you want me to go? Well, Mr. Mahat. Mahat. Here comes the cavalry. What's the problem? I mean, it doesn't take a genius to figure out that we got some idiot down here wielding a camera thinks he knows what he's doing. Videotaping, security stuff around here. We don't know who you are. We don't know what you're up to. Right now, you're just some sketchy guy. A.K.A. Potential threat. Do you want me to wait or do you want me to go? Alright. You alright, mate? How you doing? Yes, sir. You're right, mate. How you doing, okay? Yeah, not too bad, mate. Not too bad. What are you doing? Just, just my thing, mate. Mean my own business. You're traveling? 
Uh, I don't answer personal questions, mate. Okay, but, uh, right, right. I hate so much about the things that you choose to be. Everything okay, yeah? Everything all right, man. Everything yeah, all right. good man, good man. You having a good day? Trying my best. It's getting cold, isn't it? Very cold, man. You must get drafty in here. Yeah. Get a hot drink. Try and stay warm. Well. Have a good day. Bye-bye. See, he's all good. It's not that he's all good. He, maybe he just didn't want to make a big deal out of it. Maybe he needs his job. You know what I'm saying? Nobody wants to be on your camera. See ya. Is in operation at this station for the purpose of security and safety management. Do you have a CCTV is recording? Hey guys up there, I don't know if you guys can see. But yeah, I think we've got. And here we go. There you go. Now he's like the security guys right up there. Let's go up there and bother this guy while he's working. It's the same thing across the pond. The unemployed go bother the employed. Hey, how you doing? Yeah, what's going on? Nothing. That's it. All right. Uh, just had a call. Obviously, someone walked past the no entry sign down there. So I seen that, but then I seen above the door that it said um, no customers beyond this point. So I made the assumption that I could walk up to there. No, you can't and then. One of the guys, he came out and he was like, oh, I can be up to here and film. Um, no, no, I've seen it. I've seen it. But, so they contradict each other because you've got that one, but there's another two signs. Wait for that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Sorry, mate. So, so I've seen the sign you're talking about, another yeah. one you're saying, but there's another two above the gates and it says no customers beyond this point. Right. So they sort of conflicting. And then when I went up, one of the guys caught a film, came out and said, oh, I can be up to here at this point where I was. And um, so long as he doesn't film cameras, but then I was like, well, if I can see it, I can film it, so... No. Don't like that. Like, put up that last way for him in a documentary or something like that? Uh, I, again, I don't answer personal questions. No, I'm just yeah. on the No, I understand that. No. Yeah. What's wrong with you? Oh, you know what I mean? Um, long are you travelling today, or...? Again, I don't answer personal questions. I tell yeah. you what, right? I'm just thinking, coming on a platform, you need a ticket to be on a platform? Does, where does it say that? Right. So it'll go down by low 18, country section 2, right, okay. 2000, right? So, uh, the post street ticket area, it's like you said, you travel, yeah, you've yeah. got a ticket on it. Uh, again, I don't answer personal questions. You've got to have a ticket. To be We're going to go back and forth for a minute in usual auditor style. We're going to skip toward the end of the conversation where he's had about enough of it. Yeah, this is the West Coast of okay. King's Cross. Is that you said the West Coast already? Okay. So, so I'm assuming you're probably going back to the West Coast. So, I don't know what part of the West Coast. So yeah. you're making assumptions. Yeah. Okay. And um, so you sh you're not giving no information. You're standing here. You're not supposed to be standing here. You ain't showed me no ticket, and you're not giving no answers. Guess I got to assume some things. You should go on what you do know and not what you don't know. All right, okay. Sir. So please don't make assumptions. You don't know what the business oh. is here. You don't know whether I've got a ticket to be here or not. Right. So, Can you show me a ticket? Okay, again, I am not going to do that. Well, we can leave the platform. Okay, so you need to physically escort me. Oh, that's good. Okay. But it will be reasonable force only, and I will is not fight back. Is there anything I can reasonably say and do to ask you to leave this platform? Please? No. Is there anything I could say or reasonably do to get you to leave this platform? He has literally given you every out one can imagine. You are literally pushing the limits on purpose. He's given you an out. You literally want to get into trouble. You just want to be able to record this. Just like all these idiots over here. Again, I don't answer personal questions, officer. Right, so, so, okay. so again, um, unfortunately, going to declare. So I may have to use the power of ejection. I don't really want to. Okay. So again, if you're going to do that, reasonable force only. I will not resist. I will not fight back. Yeah, okay. I'm no, trying. To, I'm trying to be civil. I'm not. Okay. Not going to leave willingly. Okay, not that's right. No. So what will happen is either you uh, physically well, remove me, and again well, I, I won't fight back, I won't resist, or you can go about your business, and I'll be gone in a couple of minutes. Unfortunately, I can't do that. Well, then it looks like Plan B. It is. So, um, I will go if you physically escort me. I will not fight back. What? You can use reasonable force, but. Oh, thought so. I well, can't do that. On platform 12 to 13, auditor on the platform. He's been asked to leave and he's This is bullshit. No, please leave. Okay, so again, we're going on the circles, so.
Yeah. I'm free to You're stay. Free to stay. Yeah, right. Okay, so I'm not being detained. Yeah. I'm free to go. I'm free to stay. And I'm under no obligation to answer your questions. You're leaving the station. Are you Come placing on, me under caution? Yes. There we go. So, on, hands on, hands on. No, it is, it is. Okay. Hands on. Come on, Sprinkles. Wake up a little bit. The man has put his arm, his hand on your arm. Oh, he's gone hands on. Oh, 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 no. You make it sound like you've been thrown around. Come on, sir. Can you please so, walk? As you can see, walk. folks. Yeah. Come on, okay. So, he's put his hands on me, so yes, now sir. I am under detainment, you understand no, that? You are under, and I am under, I'm not, from the station, so sir. again, I'm not under my own free will, so you've got your hands on me, yes, sir, so therefore sir. I'm it's under detainment. Yeah. Yeah. So, yeah. so obviously you do realise that you're now liable for a civil He's going to try to stall the whole way out the door, he's going to talk back and, you know, I'm going to sue you, the whole, the same thing we hear over here. It's the exact same thing. It's the same thing. So we're going to pick it up right on the other side once he's escorted out the door because he can't leave well enough alone. He's escorted out the door and still got something to say. When I tell you the stupid is strong with this one, <laughs> you see the laughing stock and yourself, you know you're complicit as well, officer, because you've allowed him to infringe on my human rights. Okay. You know that? You're, yeah. just, you're, just, as, you're, you're just as liable. Boom. Roast it. Yeah. Right. Well, so station prop, he's further down there. So we'll Is it, yeah? So am I, am I being detained or am I free to go? Oh, we'll check me from am the I being detained or am I free to go? We'll check me am from I, the station. Am I be? I'm outside the station. No, you're not. Still station prop, day. Boom. Roast it. Is it? <laughs> Look at the smell on it. You're arrogant. Yeah, the job Arrogant, man. Ego's out of control. Because you can't have a civil conversation. Uh, no, civil conversation. No, because you were wrong. Well, come on, sir. We can have this conversation on the street. You, nah, you need to put your hands back on me, I think. What? I think you need to put your Why hands... Why would you do that? Keep, keep escorting me out of the property. Why would you do that? Because you... You said you, you were going to leave. I, I am leaving. Well... We're waiting. Under oh, duress. No. Under duress. Well, so you the only thing I can reasonably say to do, once again, for you to leave the station premises. I am outside the station premises. No, you're not. You're still on network okay. rail property. Okay, that's it. Okay. Right. Well, come on, sir. I'll go back around the other side. Come on, take my arm. Do what you need to. Come on, can you please leave? Come on, take my arm. Do what you right, need to. Right, sir. Is there anything I can reasonably say or do for you to leave this station? And what's going to happen if I don't? I'm going to ask you again. Can you please leave the Is station? Is it under duress or under threat of arrest? Book him down. Right, under... sir. The time is 16. 1635, you're under arrest by law 13, white red. Right, one second, stop my camera, please. Stop my camera, please. Don't break my phone, grab my phone calls. Anything you do say, maybe get... You had every chance to put your camera away. You had every chance to walk on home and not even worry about going to jail. Now, once the cubs come out, you want to cry about, watch my phone, watch my camera, take care of all my stuff. That's not my responsibility. My responsibility is to take you down to jail. Your stuff, that's your problem.
I am the Alpha and the Omega, the beginning and the ending, saith the Lord, which is and which was and which is to come. Almighty, he which testify these things saith, Surely I come quickly. Amen. Even so, come, Lord Jesus. The grace of our Lord Jesus be with all of you. Amen.